Hello and welcome to Tude Therapy. In this tutorial, we are going to construct a DFA over the alphabet AB having substring triple B. The substring is triple B. So, as per the previous designed approach, we search for the skeleton strings. The minimum string over this criteria is triple B since triple B is triple B is a substring of itself. So we should try to accept the string that is triple B should be accepted. B B B if it should be accepted then the last state is the final state now consider example a triple B whether it should be accepted or not yes it can be accepted since triple B is a substring of whole string a triple B consider another example double a triple B again it can be accepted triple A triple B it can be accepted since the substring triple B exists in the whole string 4 A's triple B again it will be accepted therefore number of A's any number of A's in the beginning ending with triple B all these kind of strings will be accepted this calls for a self loop on our state number 1 of input A now consider another example triple b a whether it should be accepted into a dfa or not of course yes since triple b a has a substring triple b triple b double a again it will be accepted triple b triple a it will be accepted triple b followed by any number of a's the string will be accepted hence we need to put a self loop at state number fourth of the input symbol a consider another example of string triple b b it will be accepted triple b double b triple b triple b and so on all these strings will be accepted hence the infinite number of b's can come once substring triple b is completed hence we will put a self loop on the last state now check whether we have defined all the inputs over all the states check for that now for the state number 1 we have defined a and b so let's go to state number 2 for state number 2 we have just defined the input symbol b not a hence we as of now we cannot call this machine as our dfa let us suppose that an input b a triple b comes whether it should be accepted or not B A triple B will be accepted for that think about this design B followed by A and again triple goes to the further state number 4 it will be accepted now for state number 2 both inputs A and B are defined let's go to state number 3 for state number 3 we have just defined the input B not A hence we have to formulate a string consider a string double B A triple B it should be accepted or not yes it should be accepted since this string is having substring as triple B now think about this step
if we go back again the criteria will be fulfilled now for state number 3 we have defined both the inputs B and A let's move on to state number 4 for state number 4 also we have defined all the inputs that is A and B hence the given DFA is a DFA which is having the skeleton strings which uh, which is having the substring triple B thank you so much for watching this video in the next tutorial we will be taking more examples and studying about DFA happy learning stay tuned